so I, I view my ex girlfriends on one train. What kind of conversation were they having? Go get the guy, Marco. Start to adopt them. Hi and welcome, this is Gossip Girl XOXO Nah, I'm kidding, I've never watched Gossip Girl I'm Chris and yes, yeah, sadly no face for this video At least the most of it, as they say God give the bread to the one without teeth and the teeth to the one without bread or something like that anyway mr Banchan was invited on italian soil why shouldn't i dedicate an entire video about it if i was skilled back then when he was younging with versace i would have done the same but i wasn't <laughs> so here we are i really hope to find some healthy and pure blasphemy shadow in the background of some fun camp just because it's fun it's italian culture yeah i'm italian by the way if you didn't guess it from the accent <laughs> profondo sud so our story can start from the moment it was announced the scheduled flight from Seoul to Milan. At least that's what we thought. But no, ha fatto scalo a Roma like traditions. We will be lost without our traditions, you know? For the Milan Fashion Week 2024, spring summer for Fendi. Fendi, ti vogliamo tutti molto bene. The promoting contract basically starts from the airport, apparently. Full Fendi, but may I give my opinion? It looks really cool. The shade of blue matches really well with its natural colors and also easy, elegant and effective. It's wearing jeans, but it looks expensive. Not like that one time we thought... Anyway, should I give scores? No, there's no need. Let's move on the timeline. So basically from Seoul to Rome is quite a trip. Around 11 hours, something like that. While from Roma to Milano is like a little more than an hour. But how do we know that it stopped over at Rome? Because the first pics came out. And now this is me checking Twitter the night in question. Enjoy my pretty face. I know you miss it. Hi, oh, sorry. I was watching Paolo Bonoli's talk. I have a guilty pleasure, I have a guilty pleasure too. This video was not supposed to be made. Uh, I'm about to tell you what is going on right now on Saving Italia on Twitter. X, we don't call it X in real life. Nobody does that because it's hilarious, because it's wonderful. Basically, people are going crazy because the uh, channel was spotted the report of Rome uh, Fiumicino and it's incredible I fucked up my my TL on uh, on my fake account for this because now it's full of Italian TikToks it was not supposed because that was it's, it's, for all, it's also full of now Stray Kids memes it was not supposed to be on Stray Kids memes now wait let me aspera, let me go my normal many <laughs> forgiveness uh, I'm going to translate it for you and if Italians are about to aim me or compound on a little cut song. Ah, first of all, the guy sang uh, from Martino Campanaro, but with different words for some reason. We don't know why, but he's the only one in the world that knows this song. Because I never heard this version. Ciao, buongiorno, ciao, buongiorno, come stai, come stai, molto, molto bene. Molto, molto bene. Grazie a te. Grazie a te. Probably gonna use this on my ringtone from now on. Okay, now shut the fuck up. Even if I always have my phone on mute, so the day I'll decide that my, my volume on, it will be like in 10 years. Eh, from 10 years from now, I will be like, what the fuck is this? Okay, I don't mind the honjung on my... It's normal. Um, yeah, this is me uh, being really happy because Fendi clearly knows how to style her jeans. I was a Nama Pier Gelato, which is from an Italian uh, TV series, and it's hilarious for me. And then people are also uh, making uh, parody bubble messages like, uh, <laughs> Hi, how are you? I'm at the airport in Rome, and I hear people screaming. <laughs> Bang Chan, uh, Sky, Sky, how do you say Sky? But landing in Rome to take another flight later on, and he's already naked. Yes, that's how Italy works. They are going to die on July because on July, with all the people, the atmosphere will be insane. I'm even quite happy that I'm not going. Thinking about it, it's a festival, so there's going to be really a lot of people. I'm tall, like two apple and a half. I'm like I'm smart, so I would not see. Shit. If they are going to do a world tour, maybe in Palazzetti. Okay, basically people are dying. This is wonderful. I think I'm in love with this. I think I have some screenshots. Yeah, I have a lot of screenshots, honestly. Today the sun is shiny because Ben Chan is coming to Italy. Yeah, I agree. Now, this one I will not uh, I will not translate it for you. I'm sorry. I, uh, I, I'm not... No, no. 
Dora, ti prego, ti invito perché cazzo è Bajan. Dora, please tell me what the fuck Bajan Bajan is. The minimum is that once he's back in Korea, he's going to do uh, psychological terrorism to the others for the, the hot uh, hair. No, honestly, it's hot in Italy. Mm, 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 mm. He already blessed all Rome. Not even the Pope is able to do something like that. Okay, no, this is not what I'm There are memes that are only Italian memes. Okay, that's it. My wish for tomorrow is to see him dressed like he deserves to be dressed. Like full Fanny, but like something incredible. I think Fanny is kind of quite good as a, in a dressing people. Not the... Mm, no, let's not talk about ethical things. Also, he was dressed quite good today. So it should be, we should be fine. See you later, I have to record other videos. Ciao! A few minutes later. Hi, I'm back again because in the middle there are uh, news. If it wasn't for that he, he was coming to Italy, I would have never even care. But uh, I'm really interested about uh, uh, Italians' reaction to the guy. We can be really polite, but we can also be legends. If there's something, I will translate it for you because I'm a snitch. No, with the music, you really put the music in it. So I don't care. Chani. Chani in the most Italian way I have heard. Vabbè, well, landed in Milan. Did you watch the, 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 the match? Milano malpensa, ma quella che malpensa sono io! Io mi inchino, aspetta. Because this was... A little bit too much. Allora, uh, I'll explain the, 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 the word joke because uh, this was, is supposed to be... I don't know if it's safe for the screen, this person, aspetta. Mano Malpensa is the name of the airport, should be. Malpensa, mal, uh, bad, and pensa, thinking. Bad thinking, like dirty thinking, that's the thing. Milano Malpensa, but the one that's thinking dirty is me. Oh, it's wonderful. Say bellissimo. Oh. Someone is saying, sei bellissimo, eh, you're beautiful, they, they said to him, you're beautiful. They, there's even a chant, an Italian chant that they could do, like, uh, sei bellissimo, but they, sometimes they even start to say, no, 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 make it, make it, because we are iconic. Vabbè, basta, there's nothing else. Hi, Bang Chan! <laughs> Sorry, the way he said it, he was so scared, mamma mia, si scantò, io pure mi scanto così. I get scared like that too. Mamma mia, si sente che stanco. Si sente, si fucking tired, I'll leave him alone now. Let's see what he's going to happen next. You know, the funny part in all of this, and the one I'm most grateful for, is that in this way I had the occasion to find Italian stays on Twitter, and boy, they're hilarious. Now I'm gonna translate everything, because what happens in Italy stays in Italy. Sorry, not sorry. Anyway, people were like waiting for him to get to Milan safe and sound, and I was too, because I have a little fear of flies, and also I feel like I adopted the guy, like a miss mother now. I don't, don't ask, don't, I'm a, don't make, don't do, find your fucking business. So I was like, when I arrive visa vis and it did. All the pictures did. Can we appreciate that even if there was a little bit too much people in a very little space, nobody jumped on the guy. Like I remember with Yanjin people went crazy. But also I think we couldn't do worse than Korean photographers. They like shoved the camera in front of their faces. Like what the fuck, that's sick. Cultural shock, I guess. Yeah, 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 yada, yada, yada. Anyway, interesting how it took just the June temperature to leave him in a tank top. Because, boy, you are not ready what the July temperature will be. Also, all those people in the same space bring deodorant. Anyway, the day after, I just know that he was supposed to sleep and he didn't. And you know why I know that? Because I was awake too. <laughs> yeah, that's it, that's it. You're the second clip from that day. Hi, still me. Still the same night. For the... Really, it was a coincidence. I was still recording. Basically, I just uh, opened Instagram on my phone and there was... Bang Chan notification and since I made my cell phone giving you uh, a full what's word I don't remember what's the word the full experience of Bang Chan in Italy I just going to show you what's going on it really was a concern I was I was like recording the one this episode seven and eight so i was already awake but it's not that that weird for me to be awake it's weird that it's almost 5 a.m and he's awake but i guess jet lag 
nervous agitation struggling with everything else so basically what he posted on instagram was what they sent him about a friendly who sent him to the hotel they sent him this bag i guess it's a bag i don't know it's weird you know what it looks like like a bluetooth uh, stereo something like that it's a bluetooth uh, stylish but luxury i don't judge i mean we are really really grateful we're really grateful we're all happy the more italian brands bring chickens in italy the more <laughs> the more the best it is because i like the idea and suddenly we start to adopt them do you remember when we adopted mika there was a period of time where mika was everywhere in italy because he used to be a judge on uh, x factor and for some reason by chan the australian guy that lived half of his life in korea has a better italian pronunciation of mika there is any uh british and lebanese liban half british half lebanese of French person. Oh, but yeah, I better than. My friend is confused as me. I was walking down the hotel, I guess. And that's it. Always looking. Standing as ever. It's like Megan Fox. You cannot say that Megan Fox is not hot. Or is not beautiful. She's beautiful. She's also smart. She's so fucking smart. And if you say that you don't like Megan Fox, you're like, um, mm, you're trying it a little bit too much. And that's the same with Bunch. Not that I care that much. Anyway, uh, I think I will never do this thing again. I'm doing this thing with Chan because, well, because he, because it was he, it was all of a sudden bad. And you will think, please, now go to sleep. No, no, I have to record something else. See you later. Mesmerizing, isn't it? Anyway, the day after, just a little before 1 p.m., Twitter is already the guy left the hotel, I repeat, the guy left the hotel with a skirt. Not that I care that much, but it looked really cool. And I appreciate it a lot. We all love men in skirts, right? So imagine my surprise when he came out of the car for the runway with a total different outfit. change inside the car like it's there's there's a loophole here like it's not why a different i mean the r.i.p pretty skirt that we love for five minutes you will never be forgotten apparently this outfit was from the end collection for winter and i actually love it you can tell they nailed his entire vibe like they are spot on and they oh third outfit people outside of the place were all all there for him look at that <laughs> I love this outfit, really. This yellow is really something else on him. It's uh, eye-catching. I'd like to add something else now that I'm editing. My friend looks taller. Four apple instead of three. It's the power of the long coat. Sherlock Holmes used the same trick. Okay, we saw the outfit. Nice. Are we done? Done. And the gossip? Huh? So naive, aren't you? As Twitter was so kind to tell us, it took him less than a minute for already be on the way to make friends with Harry Styles. That actually kind of hurts me deep in my I, soul. I, no, I'm kidding. It's Nicholas Galaxine. Galaxine. English actor. The guy from Red, White and Royal Blue. The idea of you. Such a fine actor. If you haven't seen him acting yet, do yourself a favor and do it. Especially the idea of you because I really loved it. Because then Anne Hathaway. I, oh my God, I'm going to faint for a minute and then I'm going to come back because Anne Hathaway. Eh, eh lo so, te l'ho detto. <laughs> te l'ho detto, cazzo. Ba but he's really good. I've never been into One Direction or any style whatsoever, but if I don't know the plot. Anyway, Nicholas has a message for Bang Chan, apparently a message of peace or brotherhood. Uh, so I, I view my ex girlfriends all Australian What kind of conversation were they having? You know what? Man talking? I don't want to know. Keep your secrets. Ma si, Nicola, fa un po' come cazzo ti pare? When did this become a whorehouse? A lot of press pictures, even with the CEO of Fendi, Pierre Emanuel Angeloglu, is new also. Apparently he's a... He, he, he 
is the CEO of something else too. And he just became CEO of Fanny like this June, like the first of June. So well, congratulations. I don't know. Barbro è francese. And with Ren Megur, singer and actor, member of the Snowman, a Japanese idol boy band. Uh, they are quite big apparently. They talk a little. <laughs> For like, I followed the live on YouTube stream by Fendi, and the chat was constantly only for Banchan. Only Banchan. People were asking for Banchan. So I believe that at some point, whoever was behind the camera just located the guy and kept coming back to him for the engagement. But anyway, photo, 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 video, video, video. My outfit. I actually really, really like my outfit. The coat, the pants, the shoes, the bag. The bag. Very nice. The bag. Oh, very Hello, Bazaar Singapore! Um, I am Strikers Bang Chan. I'm here at the Fendi Men's Fashion Show. Can't wait to see what's gonna come out. Um, I miss my members a lot, but everything is going to be okay. Miss my members a lot. Bro, it's been less than two days. <laughs> Alright, can you just fuck? So, uh, they also. C'è Marco Mengoni e nessuno me l'ha detto! Allora, first of all, let's just appreciate a little. Thank you very much. Marco, senti, ma tu com'è che lo sai che io effettivamente non dormo mai? <laughs> My honest and mature response on seeing that, on seeing Marco there too, was a really chill tweet that was basically Go get the guy, Marco! Can you imagine Marco Mengoni and Bang Chan in the same song? It's so unbelievable that I cannot even imagine. Chan, come on. Even Mika did a fit uh, with Italian people. Elisa did a fit with the Muse and Alessia Cara with Fedez too, even if Alessia Cara is Italian but she's an alpha. Canadian, but you get the drill. There's a lot of international duets that are achieved by Italian singers. We are good, I promise. Some of us. So I was watching the live while I was like working on other things, so I might have missed something. Surprise, motherfucker. I was wondering why they didn't put an international singer like Mengoni next to another international singer like Banchan. Why, Nicolas, are you here, my friend? And who is this woman? We did, we don't know. She seems nice, honestly. But there's not that much space at all for all these people in that bench who assigned the disposition of the guests. Topo Gigio. Update, the girl in pink is Delfina de Letres Fendi, heiress of the Fendi house and daughter of Fendi artistic director Silvia Venturini Fendi. I can't believe it. Anyway, I was that shocked when Marco made his way for the very same bench, but... Okay. It's, it's fine, Marco. Fai l'uomo. Approach al picciotto. He did it. Marco, I forgive you just because a few meters from where you are, there's... There's... There's Tana Nine. Oh my god, I need to say some blasphemy. I'll be back in a minute. A few moments later... Oh, but there's Mr. Rain too. Chavit, so you're telling me? Marco Mengoni, Bang Chan, and Tananai and Mr. Rain were all in the same room, breathing the same air, and I wasn't! I'm so jealous of you, Bang Chan. No, wait, I mean, okay, oh, um, uh, la, la, t Tananai! <laughs> But sorry, but then I'm sorry. Let's do the new Aldo Moro gate. It might sound like the initial part of a joke, but let's just put it in that way. Marco Mengoni, Tananai, Mr. Rain, kidnap Bang Chan. It's perfect. No, it's illegal. No, no. Last time I checked, it wasn't illegal. Trust me. Multiverse is a concept about which we know frighteningly little. Welcome to the Stray Kids Hot Mega. I'd like to apologize for my behavior. It will probably happen again. I suggest you to take a pause now because I understand that it can be quite confusing in my way of editing, but it's the representation of how my mind works. So imagine my struggle. <laughs> And the actual show starts and boh, do you want my opinion on the collection? But honestly, really good. They love the colors, the moccasins in our society are something that in 2024 should get rid of and banned for the rest of the eternity. But apparently we have this thing called free will, so nice job. I guess. Uh, then the show ended. So what happened next was just Banchan leaving the place like a princess. <laughs>
And now we wait until someone corrects him on the Ciao Buongiorno song and have him try, I don't know, La Garbonara Vera. I don't trust Milano, honestly. Let's see what else is going to happen. Banchan with Fendi, Yanjin with Versace, Lino with Gucci and Chambi with Dolce and Gabbana. If we play our cards in the right way, we can steal. I'm joking, I'm joking. Love audience. Ah, rumors in the wind. Twitter, it was Twitter, no, it was not the wind. Told me that apparently the guy was surprised by how many people were there for him. And you know, that basically confirmed my <laughs> theory or just my knowledge of the fact that, yeah, you can't see everything. Update! The guy left Italy, Italy immediately after. No, you have not fatto fare an aperitivo. Which, okay, like it will collapse one day if you don't let him rest even for an hour. After all the emotions, he must have felt in a short amount of time. I'm not an expert, but I'm quite good on what uh, can induce anxiety and stress. Let's say that I have a lifetime supply of it. And this doesn't sound healthy, but again, it's more than 12 hours flight and they probably are about to announce to come back. Sette va quando c'è tempo, so it makes sense. Anyway, give the guy some pappareale, I don't know. And maybe don't whitewash him, because there's no need. Another little update. Apparently, we adopted uh, Nicholas as a uh, boat mascot. I'm okay with that. <laughs> Ah no, the real update wasn't this. When Chan uh, landed in, uh, in Seoul, in Korea, it was still full Fendi and I like to say how much I find it funny that they even gave him a, a beanie in summer. <laughs> Just because... Can't <laughs> bust about. And now for you, a bunch of memes that I found around the place, I don't know. Okay, probably never again. Ne never again. No, it must be worth it to, for having me do that again. Thank you for watching. You can find my social information box. If you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe. Have a nice day.